Hello and welcome. This is the scene here in East London, in Stratford to be exact. We're at the London Stadium. I'm Derek Ray and keeping me company in the commentary box today is, of course, Stuart Robson. And on the menu, action from Europe's Premier Club competition, the Champions League. This the first leg of the semi-final. It's West Ham United up against Olympic Lyonnais. Well, Derek, they don't come much bigger than this, do they? This will be a top quality game between two of the best sides in Europe. Let's hope it lives up to its billing. United. Well, I think they have a nice balance to their team. A solid back four, two holding midfielders, three creative players in advance of them, and a mobile centre forward. It's a good team. Olympic Lyonnais starting lineup. Anthony Lopez begins in goal. Emerson plays with Leo Dubois in the fullback positions. And in this tactical setup, they have just the one player in attack. And underway now in this Champions League semi final first leg. Encouraging move from West Ham. Delivering it into the box. Still a chance. Well, you never quite know who's going to dominate a game in advance, but I think you can maybe make an argument for this fellow, Stuart. What do you think we'll see from him today? Well, Derek, he's so dangerous in the air, but it's not just his aerial ability, it's his movement in the box that buys him that little bit of space to get on the end of crosses. Whether it's in front of defenders or drifting in behind them, he always seems to be in the right place. For Niles. On the ball, Mikael Antonio. Opportunity to deliver the cross. And a harmless cross gobbled up. Oh, commanding goalkeeping. Toko Ekambi. And he read it superbly. Declan Rice. Jared Bowen. Well, that's how to blunt the edge of the opposing attack. Maxence Kakeri. Won it back. Suchek. Jared Bowen. Here's Manuel Lanzini. Well, technically offside, but not by a lot. Dembele. Well, they did have the ball, but not anymore. Oh. 
Suchek. Here's Manuel Lanzini. Antonio. Promising looking attack from West Ham, but really sticking to the task defensively. Paqueta. Maxence Kakere. Now Dembele. Intelligent threaded pass here. And nothing positive comes of it, unfortunately. Really sitting deep now. That could be problematic. Dembele. Dembele. And the keeper making sure that there were no scraps to feed on for the attackers. Antonio. Suchek. Jared Bowen. And a free kick awarded by the referee. straight into the meat of the penalty area able to get a body in the way just can't get it past them Lucas Paqueta Raul Toko Ekambi with it well they stopped them in their tracks Antonio Jared Bowen, that's a useful cross. Extremely sloppy in possession. Succeeded in keeping it in play. Dembele. Dembele. Terrific block. Dembele. And as a defender, you really have to concentrate to the maximum to bar the door, as he did then. A chance maybe from the wide position. That's not a bad ball. Well cleared away. Will this corner bear fruit for them? Well, just listen to these fans. They're urging their team to score here and take the lead. So the corner played into the box. Goalkeeper's ball, it was always going to be that way. And the whistle is sounded for half-time in this game. Well, he's got a few things right in this first half, but not everything. Yes, there's certainly room for improvement. He struggled to have any real impact on the game. He hasn't got on the ball enough, and when he has, he's given it away cheaply. But I'm sure we'll see a marked improvement in the second half. Second half of this Champions League semi-final first leg underway. Ndombele. On to Paqueta. Oh, good use of the ball. Good looking ball. Ndombele. Maxence Kakere. And a strong tackle.
Jared Bowen. On the ball, Mikael Antonio. Lanzini. And good use of advantage. The referee allowing play to continue. Well, he's gone back and awarded the free kick because there really wasn't much of a tangible advantage. Well, some referees might have elected to hand out the yellow card, but no booking on this occasion. Well, the free kick needed to be a lot better than that. Straight into the wall. And there it is! The first goal in the semi-final! A huge moment! Extraordinary scenes! Well, as you can see, he doesn't mess about here, does he? He's strong, well-balanced and skillful. That's a top-class finish. And the substitution will occur now. And the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? Moving the ball nicely, looking for that final pass. Options in the centre. Clubs clear. Aaron Cresswell. It's a weighted pass. And a poor ball. And we're into the final half hour. Awa. Leo Dubois. Well-timed tackle. Declan Rice. This might be ideal for the counter. Will they profit from this situation? It needs an accurate cross. Lanzini! Oh, wonderful save! Well, he reacts so quickly there. That's a great save. Substitution then. Let's see how it affects the match. Who can they pick out? And clears his lines. Jared Bowen. And that was a very fine read. Toko Ekambi. Well, he's outplayed and outfought him. Could be! Well, a shame that he couldn't find the target from there. Suchek. Antonio. The tackle taken away. And beating the defender. Perfect tackle. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. 
All hands on deck. Antonio. It's a neat move. Tackling and winning the ball to boot. Leo Dubois. Dembele. They get forward, but time is very much against them here. But nothing comes of it. Referees are rightly praised for giving advantage, but when there is no advantage, it has to be a free kick. Well, he's certainly been warned, Stuart. No more challenges like that. Well, he's in no doubt now. He can't foul again. Substitution time it is. Number 28, Tangai Ndombele, to be replaced by number 23, Tiago Mendes. Takes on the shot and pushed onto the woodwork. Well, the goalkeeper got there in the end. Well, his recovery is brilliant here, so athletic. Well, these fans have been brilliant. Just listen to the noise inside this stadium. Surely this will inspire the players to hang on. What a noise we've got. Jaron Boateng comes up with the ball. Awa. Carl Choco Ekambi with it. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. Oh, that's textbook goalkeeping. Well, this late corner could represent their last chance to equalise. And played short. Now veering in field. Emerson. And pull back. It should be. Oh, a goal! An equaliser in the closing stages. Well, let's look at this again. He's done superbly well to pick out a teammate here. And the finish is clinical. He just makes it look so easy, doesn't he? Back underway, level pegging, one goal apiece in this game. For Niles. Declan Rice. And there's the final whistle. A thoroughly entertaining semi-final first leg. And I must say, Stuart, it bodes well for the return match. Yeah, fantastic first 90 minutes, wasn't it? Exactly what you want to see at this stage of the competition. Let's just hope they can replicate that in the reverse fixture. Well, we're picking him out for a reason. He's had a tremendous game and attack, Stuart. Well, they look to be a beaten team, but he just kept going. And what a composed finish it was. He showed a lot of quality today.